hello first of all i welcome all of you to my youtube channel today i am going to do a new assignment for you the name of this assignment is co 19 ss chapter 1 greater 1 eh homework kiosk inventory i am professional here i am going to solve some part of this assignment for you if you want me to do this full assignment for you then you can contact me on my whatsapp or my email address given below in the description box i have solved this assignment for uh, many of my students and they got 100 out of 100. I am professional. I can do all these assignments of this Access course, Word course, PowerPoint course, uh, Excel course, Math, Stat, Business Math, Finance, Accounting, Writing, Technical Writing, all these things. So first of all, here we are going to look at the project description. In project description, it is saying in this project you will create a database object to track the inventories of atoms for sales in a kiosk layer located in the college snack bar you will create a table and import data from the excel to create a second table you will create a simple query a form and report this is all you are going to do uh, so this is our assess file let me again open it for you yes this is the file it is saying uh, start in the first point this project is basically consist of four files two are excel files one is instruction file and one is the exercise file in the first step it is saying start assess open the file student assess underscore one e kiosk inventory downloaded with this project create a table a table in data sheet view so here this is this uh, file student last name will be at the start of as this assignment we will go to create and here we will select create table this will create table in data sheet view next we will move to step number two in step number two it is saying let me make it the, uh, beginning in the second column of the table and using specified data types create the following field in order item short short text category short text campus short text storage location short text price currency and quantity in stock so this we are going to do so this is the file first of all in the second here we are going to select it is saying what it is saying atom it should be short text so here we will click here and select short text and here its name should be atom so this is done next is category so here we will select short text is the category category this is done next is the campus so here we will select short text and it is campus cmpus campus next is the storage location so here again short text storage location next is price so here we will select uh, it should be currency uh, it should be price this should be currency uh, i have selected wrongly you have to select currency it is done now next is the quantity in stock and it should be number so here we will select number in in stock so this is done now uh, let me make it sure that we have type all the name correctly first one is item next is the category third is campus next is the storage location price quantity and stock so these are the field we needed to add next uh, we will move to step number three 
but before starting step number three i am professional if you want me to do this assignment or do this complete course for you then you can contact me on my whatsapp or my email address my instagram given below in the description box next it is saying change the data types of the id field to short text rename the id to atom id and change the field size to 10 and save the table as 1e inventory first it is saying change the data type of id field to short text so this is id field for changing you will go to table field and here instead of auto number you will select short text and then in name and caption what it should name should be it name should be atom id atom id and at the end it is saying it field size should be 10 so this is the field size it is 255 so we will select it 10 and at the end it is saying save the table as 1e inventory so here we will try to click on it and click save and here i am going to just copy this name control c here and here i will select control v paste and okay so this is done now next we will move to step number four but before starting step number four i am professional if you want me to do this assignment or do this complete course for you then you can contact me on my whatsapp or my email address given below in the description box next it is saying add the following three records to the 1e inventory table and then close the table so first is c1 so here for easiness here i am going to just copy this field atom id here i am on the home tab here i am going to paste it next is the item item is chocolate bar again similarly copy it and here i am going to paste it for the category i am candy i am going to copy it and here i am going to paste it similarly for the campus it is southeast i am going to copy it and here i am going to paste it similarly for the storage location se 100 i am going to copy it and here i am going to paste it similarly for the price price is 0.89 i am going to copy it and here i am going to paste it similarly quantity and stock i am just going to copy it and here i am going to paste it or you can just manually add this record you can type just type then for easiness i am going to copy it similarly c2 item paste it and category i am going to copy it paste it campus is southeast paste it similar storage location se 100 a i am going to copy it here i am going to paste it for price 0.5 i am going to copy it and here paste it similarly quantity and stock is 500 i am going to copy it and here i am going to paste it similarly for the last one it's t1 i am going to copy it and here paste it similarly item t-shirt here i am going to paste it similarly category clothing i am going to copy it and here i am going to paste it next campus is southeast i am going to copy it and here i am going to paste it next is the storage location this is se 100b i am going to copy it and here i am going to paste it 
next is the price price is 17.5 we am going to copy it and here I am going to paste it similarly quantity in stock is 100 I am going to copy it and here by selecting 0 we can paste it so this is done next it is saying save this table I am going to save it and then close it it is done next we will move to step number 5 but before starting step number 5 I am professional if you want me to do this assignment or do this complete course then you can contact me on my whatsapp or my email address given below in the description box next it is saying append the append the records of the downloaded files excel files a0 e inventory xls to the 1 e inventory table and then open the table in date sheet view so here i am just going to uh, go to external data new source from files excel and which it should be inventory so here i will select append a record click borrows and here where the files are located so here let me find out where these files are located Go course assess I have done all these assignment if you want me to do this complete I can do this complete for you next and here I will click finish and then I will just double click on it so you can see there are 17 records as it has been said uh, if you want me to do this full assignment then you can contact me on my whatsapp or my email address i will provide you help and all these academic courses thanks for watching my video and don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel goodbye